Hi everyone, it's Nick, how are you all doing? I'm bringing you another free video from Edinburgh Youth Theatre and today we're going to be doing step three of our character development. So last week we looked at the physicality of our characters, uh, so hopefully by now we should have a good shape and body for our character and now we're going to add the voice and this is when the character really comes to life. And again, just like last week, we'll be able to tell loads about this character just by the voice that you give them. We'll be able to tell their age, uh, we'll be able to tell where they're from, we'll be able to tell how they're feeling, and we'll also see a bit more of this rhythm that I was talking about last week. So when we were observing these characters walking past your house, uh, we probably didn't hear what they sound like. So this uh, part of the exercise is where you can be really creative and you need to come up with this voice by yourself and give it to this character. Get out all those notes that you've been making over the last couple sessions, especially those ones from the first session. Um, and these, again, are gonna be really, really useful when we're creating this voice. So the first part of this uh, process of creating the character's voice is um, I want you to think about their accent. Now, when you give them an accent, we will be able to tell where they're from. So that's a nice little bit of backstory. And we are gonna be creating more of a backstory for these characters later on, but this is gonna be a nice little um, first part of that. Um, maybe they're from Edinburgh. Um, maybe they're from elsewhere. I've heard loads of good accents at EYT, so maybe that's something that you can play around with. But of course, they might just have an accent similar to yours. That's absolutely fine as well. The next thing I want you to have a think about is their pitch. Now, when I talk about pitch, I want you to figure out if they have a higher voice on a higher register, so maybe it's up here or maybe they have a lower voice on a lower register, so maybe it's down here. Or it could be anywhere in between, so play around with it, see where their voice lies. After that, I want you to think about the quality of their voice. So are they soft-spoken? Are they loud and confident? Uh, do they have a croaky voice? Do they have a, a polite voice? Or are they a bit sassy? So I want you to see if you can find that quality and put it into your voice. And this especially is gonna tell us loads about this character's personality. And the last thing I want you to have a look at is again, their speed and rhythm, the speed and rhythm of their voice get out your notes from last week we we spoke a lot about the rhythm last time um, so um, have a look at what you found when you were exploding their rhythm and now we're going to try and put that rhythm that we found on their body and I want you to see if you can put that into their voice so do they speak fast do they speak slower do they stutter do they run out of breath when they get to the end of a sentence because they're talking so fast and so much try and find that speed and um, again put it into their voice. And once you've found all of these things and found their voice, maybe you can try reading a book out loud in this character's voice. Maybe you can try having a conversation with yourself or with somebody else in the house. Um, yeah, keep practicing with this voice and try and get used to using that voice. And that's it for today. So I want you to write down, like we always do, everything that you find out about this character, especially the things that you find out about their personality, just by exploring their voice. And now after this session, we have a living, moving character with a voice. Uh, and now we can start to explore their personality a bit more. Next week, we will be looking at their backstory, like I mentioned earlier. So we're gonna try and come up with this character's story, and this is gonna tell us loads more about who they are, and it's gonna let us explore their personality a bit more. So guys, have fun, let us know how you get on, and I will see you next week.